They're gonna fight! 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 This is not supposed to be a prehistoric cage fight. Yes, it is. Hey guys, we are playing Jurassic World Evolution. Now, I've seen a lot of people play this game. It was just, I was thinking, hmm, I should play this game. Anyway, let's hit this button, see what happens. Ooh, we got a couple of them. I also bought everything on here, like these things like Return to Attractus Park, Clara Satter, and yeah. Okay. All right. Hello. May I say welcome? Hi. My name is Dr. Ian Malcolm. You may have heard of me. Yep. Well, correction, you should have heard of me, especially now that you're here. All right. So before you are the islands that you need to manage, if you can. Okay. The five deaths. Jeez, if only, if only there had been five. All right. Oh. Oh, this okay, is this is as good a place as any to begin. Isla Matanceros. Ooh. It's relatively stable. Okay. Yeah, you can, uh, you can get your feet wet here. All right. You should. Just diving into the deep end of the pool is where the big, angry, hungry things are. Ooh. And uh, you want to be ready Amazing. before you try that. See what happens. Let's see what happens. All right. I'm Cabot Finch, public relations and crisis management, and I'm here to help you. All right. You'll start by building a Hammond creation lab. Also, I think this is just going to be a one part series. We've already started on an enclosure for you. You should just attach it to the side. But watch out for dinosaurs. Ah, <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> All right. Okay. Hamming Creation Lab. Bring dinosaurs to ear Jurassic World. All right. Uh, where can I place? Wow, there's a lot of states. Well, I guess they are asking me to place it here. Let's focus on what you're here to do. Which is create dinosaur facilities on the islands we call the Five Deaths. All right. Actually, Las Cinco Muertes, <laughs> because Spanish is the lingo of choice around here. Okay. All right. Wait for to, the construction to be complete. You'll need to connect it to the pre-existing network of paths and the power grid. Okay. Uh. All oh, right. Now comes the real test, incubating a dinosaur. You'll start with a Struthiomimus. Select the creation lab and pick a hatchery bay. There's enough genome data for your first viable dinosaur. Oh, right. Okay, let's see what happens. Incubate dinosaur, Struthiomimus. Oh, that's correct. Incubate. The machinations of the ambitious, undoing extinction, playing with nature's laws, all right. What can possibly go wrong? Come on, Doctor. You know we've learned so much and invested even more in our Jurassic operations since the last time. Okay. Yes, Mr. Finch. Yes, the the last time. There's always a last time. Last time. The next. Release. <laughs> Ooh, this is good. It begins the most precious moment, the result of incalculable actions and reactions, trials and errors, genetic mutations and unknowable combinations, chaos, all leading to a living, breathing, thinking being, an entity, distinct and unique. And now we, you, just manufacture them. So, well done, I guess. All right, okay, uh, what now? 
The Hammond Foundation has three main areas of interest. All right. Security, entertainment, and science. I've already nudged the heads of each division to reach out to you personally. Okay. They'll offer opportunities and incentives for you to be part of their team. All right. Choose one of their contracts. It'll help you develop your facility. All right. Uh, which one should we choose? We will choose science. Ah, Dr. Dua. This is our new director of operations. I'm aware, Cabot. I'm Dr. Dua. I run the science division of our operation. Okay, you're going to need to build your reputation in the science division. Not easy with me around, but you'll manage. That means managing our dinosaur population and seeing that they are flourishing. Build and construct a explore center, that says. Contracts can be requested from the division heads inside the control room. Complete these to increase your reputation and gain additional revenue to keep expanding your park. Awfully expensive, wow. So, one more thing. Your reputation. Your rep, quote unquote. Alright. Keep an eye on it, okay? Okay. If you have a solid reputation with a division, you're more likely to benefit from them. Financially, I mean. But, like life, it's a balancing act. Each division is vying for your attention, and if they don't get it, they tend to take it personally. Okay. Um, where does Shrufio Minus? There he is. I can't click on one. People them. think money makes the world go round, but they're wrong. Contracts Whoa. make the world go round, my friend. There's a lot of stuff to and commitments. Complete a contract, and your rep with the science division will increase. Character. Meaning, you'll this be able to take on more complex and challenging missions. You're welcome. Hmm. Wonder what these are. Islands management. I'm Claire Deering, and I've been on these islands before. On Isla Nublar, Monster. I made some mistakes, and I've tried to set them right. I believe in what we're doing, and I believe in these dinosaurs. Activities, contracts for the cursed island. Responsible management of our animals is key. Continue. As is creating a safe environment for our visitors. Transport emission, or what that says. Get a 50 genome trust. opportunity for you to consider. It will allow us to work together to create life pure life if you've been listening to dr malcolm then you know how important this is to us and to me do we have guests we just see do we have guests we have guests but we'll leave <laughs> they're leaving fast i knew you were my kind of person inquisitive driven and i knew you couldn't resist this opportunity all right so let's get started okay um sure together we can create a more authentic version of our dinosaurs that means a complete genome and i think you are up to the challenge don't disappoint all right okay um get a 50 percent genome on the triceratops what else do we got we got guests uh operations ranger station hmm well we'll need one of these uh, we'll just build something like that. Uh, how about we go to guest coast? We do have a few guests at our park. We will do, we'll actually put a, I guess a food thing right there. And we'll start some research or, it's not the research station, is it? Research station number one. The research center lets you improve your park in various exciting ways. All right. New buildings, upgrades, and more await. So I have a couple things. The medication requires one. All right, go back to more. You got the electricity fence I might need. Merch shop. Uh, blah 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 blah. blah. All right. So. Let's get down to business, shall we? A 50% genome. Okay, we got it. We got it all. An expedition center will allow you to send dig teams around the world in search of new dino fossils. 
DNA can be extracted from these fossils, which our scientists can then turn into living, breathing dinosaurs. And that's our true lifeblood. Good! Your first expedition team is out. They'll bring back what they find to the fossil center for extraction. Okay. Um. Whew. All right. Uh, look at this medication thing, Your job just is in simple, case. Really? Create dinosaurs, which attract visitors to your facilities, brings in capital. Ooh, he's hungry. Money, huh? Which means you can do more research to build better Feeder. facilities and create more dinosaurs. And there you Place go. this one in. A circle of life. He's a herbivore, Nature right? Commerce. Yeah, a herbivore. Simple. All right. So, um, what do we got? Oh, uh, we completed research. Good. Wait. Upgrade. We have 11 upgrade buildings. So, Hammond Creation Lab, uh, Ranger Station, and then Acid Compact. Is that what it says? I don't know. And then Electricity. A power. Are you sure where you... S oh, it just expands your power. Yes, I'll get that. Of course. Because, uh, our power station is small, right? I'm Owen Grady. Owen to my friends. I've seen things I'd rather not talk about, but it hasn't dampened my commitment to the dinosaurs. The raptors, more generally, and me and Blue specifically. We have a special relationship, like what I have with Claire. All right. It's complicated. Anyway, okay. nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Owen Grady. Power is something we simply cannot ignore when it comes to our operations. Without power, we, uh... Well, we, we don't have any power. Yeah, that's very specific. <laughs> Should I waste money for a little thing right here? We'll do that later. Alright. Ooh. Jeep. Do we have any people walking in our park? Because it says we have six guests. Unless those six guests have been gone. Are people arriving? No. You should extract genomes from fossils that have been collected inside your fossil center. Ooh. That will increase the amount of viable data you have to create dinosaurs. I guess I'll sell that and... Well, that's gonna complete the genome, so I will think I'll sell that. Hmm, alright. Truth your mom, this is doing pretty good. Not dying at all. Alright, uh, so far, no guess. Well, hey, we have seen I'm guys. Isaac. I've been hearing good things about you. I'm in charge of the entertainment division. Oh, what good is the world's greatest show right? if no one sees it? Don't answer. That's rhetorical and painfully obvious. What I'm saying is that we need people in our parks. Fill up our facilities with warm bodies. Numbers bring revenue, excitement, and opportunities. This is what nature takes its course right here. We are making great strides so far. I believe I may be on the cusp of something wondrous. And I have you to thank, at least in part, for where I find myself. Now oh, we need we'll to put it right there. hatch and house our dinosaur. Oh! Then we uh, will know if our efforts okay. will have been worth it. Will it though? Uh, uh, am I earning any money? No, I'm not. Uh, shoot! Are there any guests in our park? Yeah. I bet you if we got a Triceratops, we may as well, uh, you know. So we'll just build up like a little path right there so I guess you can see our beautiful creatures. Alright. Uh, okay. Uh, 200 bucks. Well, I'm gonna take the risk. Go here. Uh, I'm pretty sure this has to be something. Here we go. Yeah, there's like a speed thing. Ooh, successful rating. We'll try that. Oh wait, what? A rating? What does it say? Where is it? Uh, hopefully in the end we'll get some guests. We need a gift shop, don't we? We'll put our like little gift shop at the beginning, like boom, it's at the what do you mean, no power? Wait. 
It looks like you've run out of power. That's not good. Build more power stations or increase your output. All right. Okay. Hopefully, I don't like lose all my money because uh, looking at my numbers, they're not doing pretty good. Ooh, we actually got a star. What? My money. Ooh, I'm earning two hundred bucks per minute. All right, we're doing good. Look, we have guests. The guests. Is it a scientist? All right, this goofy old mine is sleeping. For sure, we'll get a better rating when we get Triceratops. I don't know why I'm snapping my fingers. Also, again, this might also be a one-part series, but you never know. One hour later. Oh, it's almost done. The successful rating's almost done. Yeah, all right. Wait a minute. There are any meat. There's a meat creature. That gives me an idea. You know what sh we should do? We should release a creature into this uh, herbivore culture. I know it sounds crazy, but I'm gonna do it. So we're gonna go and find a ourselves a Ceratosaurus. Okay. Well, those dudes are doing that. I. That makes up to what? So wait, uh, 80. So it's gonna be 80%. That should do it. Wait a minute. Why do I even need anything to do that? Can can they fail? That'd be crazy if they could fail. Cause I don't want to waste money. That's all. Uh, no. We'll just leave that water right there. Love it. Hey, it's ready. Okay. Release dinosaur. He's ready. Here he comes. Our first triceratops. That beauty. That's such a good beauty. Do it, roar. Yeah. You're good. Our new specimens, sorry, dinosaurs, are meeting Oh, you can name them? But we want them to thrive. Can we just name them? Next assignment. We just stay on. Making sure our specimen. I named him Fee 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 Fee. <laughs> I've been monitoring what you've been up to with great interest, and I'm a little disappointed that Dr. Dua came to you for this assignment instead of bringing me into the loop as she should have done. I'll discuss this with her later. And the Struffio Minus name is Ho Ho Ho. <laughs> okay. Incubate and release a triceratops. Incubate and release a triceratops with a seven. You want me to release another one? That's it. You gave me no choice, game. I am going to release a ceratosaurus in this enclosure. The first reason is because I already released a triceratops. And you want me to release another one? You gotta be kidding me. <sighs> Whatever. I am releasing. A ceratosaurus in this enclosure. Is it done? Ceratosaurus genome is done. Complete. Alright. It's ready to kick someone's butt. I am. I'm done with this game. I'm never playing this game ever again. Alright. So, our guests seem pretty happy. But... Once you know, it's gonna be the end of them. Cause I don't want to make another Triceratops. I just wanted to make one. So you know what? This is your payback. This right here. I'm gonna do something while I'm waiting. Six and a half hours later. All right, guys. So the Ham Creation Lab is almost done, but. While we, while the, it was almost done, the power just went out. So I'm gonna take my jeep and go over to reset the power. All right, I'm coming, coming to save your power, coming to save ya, and boom, it is done. All right, so the Ceratosaurus is just gonna be done in three, two. One! It is done. Alright, this is the monster we've been waiting for a little while. Here it is. The Ceratosaurus. Ooh, good creature. 
Magnificent creature. All right. Sniff, sniff all you want. Yeah. All right. A carnivore, I see. This time, a ceratosaurus. There are distinctive spines that run down its back and a bladed horn on its head. <laughs> Just what you don't want to run into when you're out there alone or in a group. All right. Are you gonna face off? Oh man, they're gonna fight. Fight, fight, fight. This is not supposed to be a prehistoric cage fight. Yes, it is. I don't care what you say, Claire. You must take care of your dinosaurs. They're I'll never, Claire, because I want to see them fight. Fight, 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 fight. Oh, he's down. He's down. I heard there was camera mode. We need to get a good shot of this. Uh, rest in peace, uh, Triceratops. Rest in peace. Oh, man. You are just destroying him today, aren't ya? Oh, man. Did you, you snapped his neck, didn't you? Okay. If you study evolution, you quickly learn that most of it leads to dead ends. Useless mutations that are abandoned in favor of the occasional successful strategy. I'm a big fan. And now we reach the inevitable. Life begets death. But here's the question that you gotta ask yourself. Was this avoidable? The answer? Of course not. Death, it's always coming. But could you have delayed it? Well, that's maybe another story. So you know what, that is going to be it for today. Hit that subscribe button and leave a like on the video. Apart from that guys, I'll see you later. Bye! Oh, and one more thing guys, this video gets 30 likes, then I'll do a second part. Apart from that guys, see you later. Bye!